Hi there, it's Mikhail Alexienko here bothering you again. Um, just one quick position that uh, um, I was solving at some point previously. Why to move and uh, why to move basically. So what is happening in this position? Uh, white is two pawns down, right? Uh, the queens are attacking each other. The knight is undefended. What else is wrong with black's position? Since it's white to move, it makes sense to look around what is wrong with black's position. The knight is undefended. And there's a possibility to give a check. And the back rank problem, which doesn't seem too, too dangerous because there's rook c8, bishop f8 moves. And, uh, well, rook c8 doesn't work. Rook a8, rook c8, queen c3, and uh, white is winning. But it doesn't seem to be a big problem. problem. But if you keep a record of what, well, this is what I sometimes do when you have to figure out a tactical problem, it makes sense to point out the problems in your opponent's position and frankly in yours position as well. If I did a pawn on h2, uh, combination wouldn't work. So what is white's problem? White's problem is white is two pawns down and the fact that queens are attacking each other. That's pretty much it. But black's problem is the knight on e4 and the back rank problem. That's it. So, but uh, what do you do? If queen takes c3, it's knight takes c3, uh, rook a8 check, bishop f8, two pawns down. Um, you may consider queen d5 move, which looks quite active, um, attacking the knight, removing the queen, but there's uh, knight f6 and uh, black is rook a8, it's uh, rook c8 always is possible. So, um, white has nothing. And, well, frankly, white is in trouble here. So, if you want to solve this puzzle, so you can stop the video because now it would be a spoiler. Uh, combining these two factors, the knight is undefended, there's a possibility to give a check with a possible back rank problem, leads to a winning combination for white. It is knight takes e4, giving up the queen, queen b3, rook a8 check, Bishop f8 only move, knight f6 check, pawn takes f6 and bishop to h6. And black has just uh, one or two checks and the king can hide on h2. None of the check can help with this threat. There's uh, queen d1, king h2, no more checks except sacrificing the queen. Queen b1, same story. Rook c1. Not capturing, this isn't checkers, king h2. Again, just the only thing that makes sense is to sacrifice the rook, which is not helping at all. So, white is winning a piece with knight x e4. Um, for, let's say, GM I am level, this, this shouldn't be a too complicated puzzle, I think. But I was surprised to learn that for stockfish it's not that easy. And the thing is, the engine have a problem, they do not consider moves or uh, they consider them, but at some point in the future. Uh, the moves that usually are bad. Like in 99 points, I don't know how much percent of cases, giving up a queen like that is a horrible blunder, right? Knight is defending the queen, you shouldn't do that. But in that really unlikely scenario where you can do that, you must consider it. So considering it and rejecting is much better than not considering, which is what engines are doing. Uh, a rook a8 check first doesn't work because black goes bishop f8, knight e4, and this isn't checkers, so queen b3 leads to a quick checkmate, but there is queen c6, double attack, and uh, the only way white can uh, uh, play here is rook f8, king f8, and black's position is by no means lost, like as rook and two pawns in an, for two minor pieces, the position is very, very unclear, far from being a win. So white is winning only after knight e4, everything else, white is actually uh, struggling uh, for equality. So let's see, I'm gonna turn on stockfish 9. And uh, I was very surprised to learn that uh, um, I thought that the engines could see uh, uh, these kind of combinations instantly. Okay, my computer is a little bit slow now. You can see the speed is very low. Um, the speed of, uh, of uh, chess engine, how many moves it is considering is not, it's like less than a thousand, that's very low. 
So depth 22, I remember it's a depth 25 that it can see that one. We'll give it time. Come on, stockfish, you can find knight e4. But at some moment, I'm gonna, I'm gonna lock it and uh, I think it would prefer rook a8. Okay, we still have to wait, should have turned it on earlier. When you're running um, other programs, the stockfish starts, uh, um, well, not performing to its best abilities. Come on, stockfish, it says queen d5, knight f6, queen b5. One pawn down, struggling for a draw. Come on, stockfish, you can find this idea. You're a good, strong boy. Still nothing. Still nothing. Come on, rook a8, you can do it. That is why you have to guide the engine. If you if you were thinking like let's see rook a8 check if I put rook a8 check and bishop f8 it would see knight takes e4 and that queen cannot be captured but somehow uh, should have taken the print screen at some point the engine says rook a8 is the best bishop f8 knight e4 so it sees this combination but then it says queen c6 and it's not clear but somehow for a, oh finally depth 26 it found that this is a win. Depth 26 at 25, the relation was black is better. At depth 26, oops, white wins. At some point it was funny because it was considering rook a8 to be the strongest, bishop f8 and knight x e4, and giving an unclear evaluation. But when a human, after queen c6, but when a human being spots that idea, what do you do? You try different move order. And that's it, bingo. But the engine doesn't have that one. It had, um, it should have taken that print screen picture. Um, now it remembered. Now it remembered that one. So at depth 26, it found this not too complicated combination. But ironically, it was finding the good idea at some point. It's not only, that doesn't work always the same way. It found, at some point, it found rook a8, bishop f8, knight e4, considering that to be the best, and then just that didn't consider the different move order. So what I'm trying to say, guide the engine, not look blindly what it is suggesting. If you were seeing this position and seeing this evaluation, you would say, okay, of course, black has two pawns up, queen d5 is the only move, and uh, white is slightly worse. In fact, white is just crushing, but the engine doesn't spot it yet. So, poor engine gonna turn it off it had a rough day um, that's it that is the way to go knight x e4 queen b3 rook a8 bishop f8 knight f6 bishop to h6 beautiful combination it's just a five move combination right but stockfish uh, couldn't find it because it starts with very a move that is very unlikely to be a good one but doesn't mean you shouldn't consider it you should consider it and reject it if it doesn't work. Not considering is a bad idea. So it started considering knight e4 at depth, what, 26? How many of you are waiting for depth 26 to believe what engine is saying? And at depth 25, it doesn't see a win, even though there's nothing extraordinary about this position. Just could have happened in any, in any game. That's it. That's it. Just use your mind. Uh, and guide the engine, not the other way around. That's very hard to do, speak from experience, but that is definitely a correct way to go. I hope you enjoyed this example. See you soon. Bye-bye.